Hello everyone and welcome to Jumper Man Tech where we specialize in HVAC but do everything DIY and today we have a service call for a two pipe fan call unit. Thank you to everyone tuning into Jumper Man Tech. Today we have a service call for a fan call unit. I just got here and it looks like this. So the building engineers were messing around with this and they have no idea what they're doing. Hopefully didn't mess around too much so this doesn't become a disaster. <laughs> Let's go ahead and see what's going on. See a rib relay here. There's two LED lights there, nothing on. Got a red light on there. Not exactly sure what that is. Maybe it's it's a kind of fire alarm. Let's go ahead and put the system on heat. Fan started. And that light turned on. So the left relay is for heat. Just want to do a quick test and put on cooling bring temperature down and see if the other light comes on. I think that might be for cooling. Yep. So the left is heating, right is cooling. There is no cooling in the building right now. We're in heating season. It's only a two pipe fan cooler unit. Okay. Fan operates and we have no heat. So let's put it to heat and raise the temperature. wiring is looking crazy in here the car is just hanging if you don't know what you're doing don't do it <laughs> all right there's the actuator i want to feel a little stem above nope it's not open let's see let's check for power all right here's our black all right and then the white goes to all the neutrals Let's see what they're talking about. Oh, <laughs> just disconnected. All right. All right, got my meter on volt. That's neutral, this is hot. So let's check between these two. Should be energizing. All right. No power. No power. I know the thermostat is doing its thing. If when we call for heat, this comes on, call for cooling, this comes on. So what I have to do is trace out the wiring. Neutral is neutral. The black wire is just our hotline for the actuator. We gotta see what's going on between this red and blue wire. We gotta follow that and see where it goes, trace this out, figure out what's going on here. There's nothing, nothing easy about these units. I've been messed around with so much. This pipe sensor. Just sitting with a tie wrap. And you know where this thing is holding on to? <laughs> Into the drain line. Into the drain line. This has to be sensing the pipe temperature of the pipes coming in. It's sensing drain water and we're in heating season. There's no condensation. This is doing nothing. So what I wanted to do is follow the circuit, the coil, because that's being energized through the thermostat. So over here it says common is white and purple and 120 volt is white and red. White and purple goes to the neutrals and then white and red come here. All right, got a black one coming into this. So this one's sitting on the drain line. Look at this one. <laughs> they, just, they just wrapped it around the pipe. I mean, it's not sensing anything. Unbelievable. What I want to do is put these pipe sensors in the right place. If it's calling for heat, I should put this on the inlet pipe. I see if there's hot water. Then this one, what's up with this? Let's start by putting this in the right places and see if that does anything. All right, got 104 degrees on the incoming pipe. So I'm going to put this one on there you know these come with a little bracket they're all gone so that's why they got tie wraps hopefully that does it so let's just try this for now it is on the hot pipe and hopefully that will open up this actuator all right guys i'm gonna try to get the camera in there for you to see see this is loose the valve just opened because the pipe sensor was sitting on the drain line 
and that's your hot water pipe. So it wasn't sensing any heat. It's not gonna open it up because we have emergency electrical heat in this kind of system. Let's check temperatures. Got my thermometer in the supply grill. Hope you guys can see it. We're at 106 degrees and climbing. This thing is an absolute disaster. Relays hanging, wires, pipe sensors in the wrong place. I mean, looks like a tornado hit this place. <laughs> Jeez. All right, well, a lesson to be learned here. Call the professionals. I'm gonna mount the other pipe sensor on the inlet, both there, and try to cover it in some way. The tie wrap seems to be working. I'm not the biggest fan of that. It should be like a metal clip holding that thing in, you know, but it is what it is. And maybe try to neaten a couple things over here. I mean, look at those connectors with wires hanging off of it, relays. I mean, this thing is giving me OCD. <laughs> so, yeah, we're gonna wrap it up here, but that was the issue. And if anyone found this video interesting or helpful, please drop a like comment and subscribe as I come up with new videos every week. Don't forget to share with your friends and I'll catch you all next time.